Why, Kate Sith? Why? Why you take the keystone from us? Kate Sith, why you leave my party? I really wanted to learn how to play you and now you're gone. Also, why is Rufus always so annoying to fight? Anyways, Final Fantasy VII Rebirth, let's do it. Okay, so. This is your captain speaking. Outside your windows, you'll see open waters. Be advised there may be sudden ocean swells. How was that? Oh, me now. <laughs> this thing's practically a paddle boat. She could swallow us whole on a whim. So we're sticking to the shallow. All right, let's see. So we want to... Whoa. Where the hell are we going? Okay, so we're going north <laughs> for the story. But we want to finish up. I want to finish up all the side stuff before I do the story. And that's going to be a while. It might be a couple streams. Oh, speaking of finishing what we started. Oh, let's do the training gym. these darn jellyfish things Ow. yeah we trained for this Speak to ice oh she can't do anything right now one target at a time here it's on you you need to chill. Come right. Thank you for gifting a sub to Mr. Frog. We can turn alerts on now. I mean, there's not much time left, but alerts are on. Soldiers can't be choosers. We ate what we were fed. Well, I used to be super picky, actually. Really? Used to be. Not anymore, though. Can't be choosers in the slums, either. What about crap? Not a fan. <laughs> yeah, me neither. That's a cute little convo. What did I order? Well, I, I have leftovers from lunch today. So, Husbando's ordering whatever he wants and for himself. And I'm not sure what he's ordering, but I'm probably going to be jealous because he's going to have hot, fresh food and I'm going to have leftovers, but it's okay. I got a, uh, a katsu. Where the fuck am I going? We're like kind of off path here. Aw, my song, and then it ended. Here we go. I have a Katsu Sando coming to me. Deal with that. If you insist. I hate these guys. You need to chill. Hello, it's This calls for more Yuffie. More Yuffie. You can never have too much Yuffie. Can someone kill this thing, please, AI? I can't do it. I, 
I thought they would be. You're gonna get what's coming to you. What the hell? See ya. I thought they were supposed to be vulnerable when they're casting. Maybe it's after they what cast. What kind of meals do they feed soldiers? They put a lot of thought into making them healthy. Not much into making them tasty. Ugh. <laughs> that face says it all. Ugh. You know, it's funny. What? Didn't realize it at the time, but... We ate pretty good when we were kids. Yeah. Homegrown fruits and vegetables. And great chefs eager to use them. And a home cooked meal from mama or dad. Oh, wrong way. There they are. Ah, uh, I'm your one stop clobbering shop. At least there's no jellyfish. Cloud's still sleeping. Okay. Back to Jules. took care of our little monster problem can't thank you enough now we can get back to training fiend free excuse me sorry about it but you wouldn't happen to be the one who beat these guys in a pull-up contest would you uh watch it rookie don't badmouth us but that's how it went down right <laughs> you're tifa right after I heard how you crushed it, I knew I had to join the gym. You're the reason I'm here. Oh, wow. And I'm not your only fan. Look, all of us signed up because we wanted to be just like you. Wow, Tiva's got it's a fan club. A Thanks to you, our female membership has absolutely skyrocketed. Needless to say, we're very grateful. I didn't really do anything. Are you kidding me? You're literally my inspiration. Which is why I, uh... I want to challenge you to a sit-up contest! Sit-ups? Uh, right now? So you know, Amina's been training to achieve your look, Tifa. You'd be helping her measure her progress. Let me sweeten the deal. If your abs prove superior, I'll add a bonus to your reward. How's that sound? <sighs> okay. Here we go. This is it. <sighs> Take up Amina's challenge in a battle to see whose abs are more fab. Whoever performs the most sit-ups will win in the event of a tie, you will lose. Press the corresponding button in time with the on-screen guide to perform sit-ups. As you proceed, the guide will fade from view and you'll have to watch Tifa's movements to determine when to press the appropriate button. The more crunches you do, the more effort each one will require. When a glowing ring appears, repeatedly tap the highlighted button to keep on crunching. Oh crap, okay. I'm scared. Don't go easy on me, okay? I will. Yeah, keep it up! That was perfect. 
Where'd that come from? <clears throat> Truly incredible. <clears throat> Just like that. <clears throat> Don't you ever get <clears throat> sore? <clears throat> Beautiful. <clears throat> You're killing it. <clears throat> Incredible form. <clears throat> You're about so sonic! It's almost like your muscles are singing! <laughs> Show up. <laughs> oh shit. Having a hard time? Get back up, Tifa! I'm at a loss for words. I barely won! Uh, one wrong button press really puts you behind. <laughs> wow, you've got abs of adamantite. Thanks a lot. You put up a good fight, though. Like I said, you're an inspiration to me, to all of us. Nobody's born with a beautiful physique like yours. I can tell you poured gallons of blood, sweat, and tears into your training. Honestly, I... Sorry. Thank you. Glad I could help. Well, Take actually, the compliment! I was hoping that, if it's not too much to ask, would you, Tifa, be my muscle mentor? Me? Really? I don't know. By all means, you have my blessing. If you don't mind dropping by from time to time, I'm sure she'd benefit from your advice. Might as well. If that's what you want. Then I'll back you up. Oh my gosh! Thanks, coach! <laughs> Whoa! Muscle mentor. Has a nice ring to it. All I can do is go, stare then. at her boobs. Your extermination Jeez. fee. And is promised a little extra for helping her out. Come back whenever you want to pump some iron. You're always welcome. You know why her abs are so... You know why her abs are so like strong and and all that? It's because she has all this extra weight when she's doing a push-up. She has like weights on her. Hi, Shinra HR department, Humpty and Dumpty. <laughs> yes, we all we know all about Humpty Dump Humpty and Dumpty here. The character model is ridiculous. Ridiculously gorgeous! Ah, uh, so let's try to do the Odin fight real quick. I'm on the hunt for new love, baby. Hey. Whoa! Passengers with reservations at Costa Del Sadly. That was excellent work in completing our survey of the Corel region, Cloud. Through Thanks. your efforts, the ways in which Shinra shaped these lands for weal and for woe are now much more clearly understood. Of special interest is the gold saucer's effect on the soil, a testament to the ecological impact of What's technology. a wheel? Thank you so much for your invaluable contributions. What's a wheel and a woe? Wheels and woes? Never heard of that before. Okay, let's try Odin Power Down 1. And let's bring... Hmm, who should we bring? Who should we bring? Let's try something different. Cloud Aerith Yuffie? Wheel is an old synonym of wealth. Hmm. Look at this guy. I always love how cool Odin looks. That horse. What's the horse's name again? Oh, sleep near. Right, 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 right. Okay, he has no weaknesses. Oh, crap. Landing ATB commands. If any attacks or inflicting detrimental status effects will put Odin on the back foot. Hmm. 
both thrilling and pressuring him. Conversely, taking too many of his attacks will leave him disheartened, leading him to sound Gallahorn's warning and unleash his Zontetskin. Oh, fudge. Oh, great. ATB Oh god I'm getting hit by all of his attacks I'm not supposed to get hit by any of his attacks Tetskin already! Oh god. Rudy block. Oh shit! We're gonna we're dead. The end. Okay, yeah, you can't block that. It's a cutscene. Okay. Alright. Okay, I think we're gonna have to power him down some more Deal with that here goes whatever I'm getting that feeling She's What the hell He's already gonna do it. Looking for me? Get him. That's it. Oh my god, it's so hard to hard to dodge him I just keep getting hit let's try power down too I'll bear Tifa Lord of the Blade? Do it! What does that mean? Let's summon... Ooh! Bahamut Arisen! Uh oh. Is it too late? What is this? Shit, what the hell is this? Because 
of that freaking spatial thing. I guess even with barrier, it's still gonna just kill you. Deal with that. All right, come on, you learn. Just really have to not get hit. Not get hit. Oh fuck. Let's I got hit. Used it solo. Didn't get hit once and he still did Zantet skin? What? How is that even fair? So even if you don't get hit, he's still gonna use it? Lord of the battlefield. Oh no! Hang back! Don't overdo it. Need my help. Wait, what? Okay, well we're all on the same side. I guess that's probably good. Man, his attacks look so cool. Oh, we have a summon. with other attacks to more effectively pressure enemies what other attacks no no maybe Barrett can survive did I, I card him down, right? Oh, shit. Cloud 
survive. If anybody, it should have been Barrett. Oh, I wonder if I could, I should wear one of those. Oh shit, I fucked up already. Things that revive you after you die. Wait, 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 let's just, hold on a second. I could just put three of those on. Yeah, I have hell of those. I don't use them. Perhaps you're having an off day. You know what, I Chadley? I want to see you fight him, okay? When you just little bitch. I have exactly three revival earrings. Boom. Bring it home. Oh no, he's gonna use it again. What do we do. There's nothing we can do. Oh, fuck. What the hell? Kill him. I did not kill him. <sighs> I got nothing. I got nothing. Okay, I gotta go. Husbando is gonna be like, he's probably pissed. But tomorrow we'll do the rest of the side stuff, hopefully. Well, you certainly look ready for the beach. I've yet to go. You see, I'm afraid of the. Should I ever muster the courage, I'll be sure to pick out the perfect bathing suit for the occasion. Nobody wants to see you in a bathing suit, Chadley. As much as I love you, I, nobody wants to see that. Okay, let's try Odin at the easiest difficulty. We were close last time. We were close. Uh, we just gotta get the do get our dodges and stuff situated. Oh, and we need to use a ATB moves against him. With the power of his this is not gonna work, is it?
Keep it together. Need my help, do you? So now. Okay. Fire it one off. And pour it in all. He's pressured. Oh, here he comes. Here I go. Here he comes. Okay, we staggered him. Take him down. Say your prayer. Way dead. While I have the ATB here, let's use a um what's it called? Prey. Oh. There's this damn spatial distortion. This really messes me up. Okay. Let's focus here. Focus. Oh, we can do a summon. Okay. Alexander. I really want to summon Bahamut, but I don't know. I got this. Can I get the ATB? To do that. Ugh. Summon Bahamut Arisen! Let's go! You're up. Yes! So cool. Okay, now. Oh my god, really? Galahorn's warning. Stop it. Not looking good. Yeah, you got this. You won't regret this. Um. We got limits. He 
really headed out for Barrett. Odin Materia. Besting Odin, you've done the unthinkable. A single mistake could have spelled certain doom, but your persistence paid off in the end. With his mighty Zontetsken, this master of the blade will certainly help you cut a path to victory. Let's do this quest for the mayor. I'm on the hunt for new love, baby. Oh, aren't you? There he is. Well, if it isn't the top of the resort. I can't thank you enough for handling that mess. Is You're there welcome. anything I can do for you? Johnny, Professor Hojo. Let's ask about Johnny. Who? Oh, that ungrateful schlub. I hope the hero is enjoying his 15 minutes of fame. It won't last, and neither will his hilltop roach trap. Just give it time. That's not very nice. <laughs> Why do you talk about my Johnny like that? What about Professor Hojo? I certainly wasn't expecting the professor to do something like that. Still, I'm a simple man, and from what I gather, his experiment was of great scientific import. Oh. So while I could have done without the collateral damage, it fills me with pride to be the mayor who holds a special footnote in Shinra's illustrious history. Maybe we should just go. What about the damages? There were a few injuries, yes, but no guests were killed. In all honesty, the professor did us a service by ridding us of those rogues. The freaks were ruining our ambience. Shinra also did us a service by providing us with a generous do... Oh, uh, forget I said anything. Donation. Hmm. Hi, Doc. What's up? How's your evening going? Well, all that ugliness is in the past. Let's look to our future. One that's bright and mutually beneficial. I'm not buying it. Oh, surely I can sell you on the idea of lending the merc I've hired a hand. What's this about a merc? Oh, perhaps your associates. That makes things easier. You see, some fiends popped out of the water and assaulted a group of innocent beachgoers the other day. The young lady agreed to exterminate those pests, only to go on a bender at a bar on the beach. I paid her a handsome sum up front, too. So I intend it's to get my curious, money's worth. Is it? Oh, and after you've gotten rid of those monsters, as a personal favor, I want you to take care of that merc. Take uh, care of? She's been spending the money I paid her to do nothing but party. Each time she learns there be are some folks you don't cross. Somehow she got across the Agreed. ocean. I've no doubt you'll find her at that damned bar. Do give her my regards. All right, let's go see what this is all about. Oh, I'm like, why can't I get on this thing? Someone's driving it already. Barbecuing? What are you barbecuing? Corn? What about some hot dogs? Some hamburgers or something? So lame. Corn? I guess some people are really into corn on the cob. Kyrie! I knew it was you. Oh, hey there, Cloud. Welcome to my Costa del Sol headquarters. <laughs> I figured I'd set up shop here, in case there's trouble in paradise. <laughs> I know Juno was kind of a bust, but I'm back and better than ever. Same goes for my advertising. So don't you worry about me, my fellow Merc. 
Aren't you supposed to be working? <sighs> really? Another lecture? For a 20-something, you sound like my grandma. Maybe you should listen to your record, grandma. I have been working. Thank you very much. I figured out where the fiends are probably going to show. All that's left is to have someone else do the cleanup. Uh-huh. Let me guess. Me? Exactly. So don't try to pin it on this, Merc. The whole situation would be resolved if you did your job. Nobody likes a slacker. Man, this girl's got some nerve. And coming from me, that's seen a lot. <laughs> but if we don't do something, it's your good name that's gonna end up taking the hit. Mm. She's got a point. <laughs> so, here's the deal. Your thoughtful boss has dug up a recipe for bait that ought to lure those monsters out of hiding. All you need to do is gather the materials and make some for yourself. Here. When you're done, head to the off-limits beach across town for some monster baiting. You're coming with. Can't do this alone. According to the recipe, it looks like you're gonna need to get some rare-ass monster parts. And I do mean rare. Probably can't find them around here. Oh, did I say probably? I meant definitely. In order to do Kiri's job for her and exterminate the fiends scaring away would-be beachgoers, you must first lure them out of hiding using a special type of monster bait. First, investigate the life spring from the Gogaga and Cosmo Canyon regions to discern the locations of classified foes dwelling there. Once you best them in combat, you can transmute legendary bait from the materials they leave behind. Okay, Gongaga and Cosmo Canyon region life springs. This one. Marvel, you're so annoying. Now's our chance. Finish him off. Come on. so much in this area it's my favorite oh thank you Gerald okay so let's rest at a chocobo stop and then we're gonna go to the shit what they say Corel region good little birdie good little birdie all right what were we fighting in here again oh the jabberwock Oh, I don't remember this one. It's a bird, right? No, it's a dragon. It's a dragon. I don't. I don't think he was that tough. Maybe we've got to lure him out. Let's see if those baddies take the bait. This is a pretty beach. Use the bait. Oh, maybe I should have healed up first. I don't think we're that hurt, though. Some legend. This bait's a bust. <laughs> Whoa, hello. I think I fought some of these guys in God of War. Um, I think Ragnarok. Sea Devil. They look cool. But they're all about. Week two, ice. Exploiting their elemental weakness will pressure them. Inflicting a certain amount of lightning damage will cause them to attack less frequently. Deal with that. Okay. You got this. So it's my turn. 
Let's get serious. Go on. Okay. Oh, Aerith is kind of hurt here. You'll see. Wait to ice. It's your turn. My turn. No. Don't worry about it. Red, what are you doing all the way out here? Yeah, Just this isn't great. Leave it to me. Yeah. One more shot. Yeah, take him down. I'll finish him off. So long. This is it. Sure, can you handle that? Let's get it started. Don't kill her. I'll be really mad if you do. Don't overdo it. <laughs> Just watch. Hey. Here goes. This one's for you. Don't catch a bonus. Someone looks kind of shaky. Tagging out. Yeah. Don't stop now. Going in. Shatter. One more shot. Come on. Stinger. Let's finish this. Come on, team. Now's our chance. I'll finish him off. This is it. This one. Keep up the pressure. I've got it. Easy. Better go tell Kyrie. Right. So, uh, what about the mayor's other request? You know, the whole take care of her thing? I mean, lying isn't the greatest, but she doesn't deserve that. Not yet, at least. <laughs> Cloud's like, I'm not, I'm not putting that off the table. <laughs> Just yet. <laughs> or ever. Welcome back, fellow work. So, did you take care of those baddies? Yep. Ah, perfect! In that case, I'm gonna go tell the mayor so I can claim my reward. Hold it. Huh? The mayor had another request. Uh, uh, what was it? Said we should take care of you. He what? No, this has to be a joke, right? Hate to break it to you, Kyrie, but this is no laughing matter. <laughs> Wait, hang on a sec, please. Why would he ask you, my own business partner, to take me out? What did I do wrong? Everything. Pose as a merc, passed off my work is yours. Think long and hard. Long and hard. Oh God, I don't know. Wait a minute. Is this about my looks? I'm so gorgeous that you can't take your eyes off me, distracting you from your mercenary duties, right? That's the best you can come up with. <laughs> no, <laughs> okay, wait. you know what? Let me guess. Take her out. Are you mad that I called myself a mercenary? Or was it that I pressured you into doing all the dirty work? Or that I wasn't giving you a big enough cut? <sighs> Do you want to die? <laughs> <laughs> Forgive my granddaughter for questionable hey. sense of humor. <laughs> She's back! I was taking some time off to enjoy the sun when I heard a merc was in town. Figured I'd pay him a visit. The and, most badass well, grandma <laughs> on the whole planet. If Cloud hadn't come to your rescue, young lady, you would have been a goner. <sighs> Don't be fooled. That mayor's no model citizen. He's as wicked as they come. You need to pick your targets with care. Yeah, yeah, you've told me a thousand times. Make it a thousand and one, because you still don't get it. And she Look, never I'm will. I'm doing my best out here, okay? She never it's will. Just that some things are beyond my control. You're the one who doesn't get it. No matter what I try every single time, it's I wouldn't do that if I were you. Ah, oh. Kyrie, you know I only want what's best for you. And if you're to be the next guardian angel of the slums, 
Honestly, I kind of get where Kyrie is coming from here. Parents want kids to listen to them because they know what's best, but they don't. They just want us to do whatever they tell us. And that really, really sucks, you know? Uh, I've always looked up to the guardian angel of the slums. But that's your thing, Grandma, not mine. And no matter how much I want to follow in your footsteps and make you proud, I can't. Because I'm not you. I'm me. <laughs> I don't know. You certainly sound just like me. Oh? Oh, forgive me, dear. I know I shouldn't push you, or nitpick your technique. So how about this? We work together as partners, equals. Sound fair? <sighs> now then, shall we head home? The people need us. Yeah, please take her. <laughs> take her away! Okay. Let's go. <laughs> In any case, thanks for looking out for my little Merc. I'll be taking her back to Midgar. Try to make sure she stays there. <laughs> <laughs> Trying's about all I can do. <laughs> Thank you for stepping in back there. Uh, I was just so pissed I had to say something. <laughs> Stay strong. You too. Girl power and all that. <laughs> <laughs> Come on, partner. Coming! Actually, what say we look for one last job before we leave? Oh, I've got an idea. You see, I dug up a little dirt about that mayor. Just a little? <laughs> <laughs> so, what do we do now? We go and tell the mayor we took care of the Merc. Just like you wanted. This was cute. Kyrie is, uh, she's an interesting one. She's really annoying, but her grandma is great. Muriel is great. Wait, <laughs> where's this place? I heard you ran that little swindler out of town. I would have preferred a more final farewell. Yeah, I'm sure you would. she's gone and that's enough. As a token of my thanks, accept this reward. Sir, we've got trouble. See for yourself. They even found the secret safe. It's empty. What? You better head back. <laughs> <laughs> Look at him hobble off. He left his pastry. We hereby bequeath your ill-gotten gains to the more deserving masses. And it's signed, the first and third guardian angels of the slums. Radiant saviors of the sun-kissed. No way! <laughs> you go, girls. Ooh, girl power. <laughs> Another quest became available. All right, what time is it? 721. Okay. All right, let's keep rolling. <laughs> 